beginning of the end for Jesus' earthly ministry. He's been on earth for nearly 33 years. Uh, the first 30 year, uh, very obscure, very quiet in preparation. Uh, God had a time frame for him. Uh, the Bible says there's a time for everything, even for his son Jesus coming to earth. There was a time of when he would begin his earthly ministry. I was going to talk about something else, but somehow God moved me uh, on Friday and, and said, no, let, let's keep a tradition. Even though we're not a traditional church, we're, we're a church that's modern, a church that's contemporary, a church that, you know, really allows the spirit of God to lead, not just the leadership, but the worship team and the membership. But, but I, I did come back to the text and to Palm Sunday. And, and so this, again, is the beginning of the end for Jesus. Within a week, he will betray, be betrayed by a kiss from a disciple. He will kiss him on the cheek. And with that kiss, signal to the authorities, that's the guy you're to apprehend. That's the guy that's creating all the, 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 you know, the, 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 the problems and, and, and bringing, bringing God's heaven down to earth. Making God available and accessible. Uh, previous, you had to go through the, the rabbis and, and, and all the religious elite. But now Jesus is saying the kingdom of God is on him. It's here. I'm the kingdom of God. I'm bringing the Father's love. I'm opening the pathway so that you can communicate directly with me. So you can have access directly to me. And when you have access to me, you have access to the Father. And when I leave, when I depart in, or on earth this, this couple of weeks, uh, I will send the comforter the Holy Spirit, my spirit, so that he would be with you, so that he would abide in you, and so that he will lead you and guide you in all truth. Within the same week, he will be denied by one of the better of the disciples, supposedly. The one that said, I will never let anyone hurt you. I will stand with you to the very end. He will be tried and, and, and falsely charged and convicted of the crime and crucified on the cross between two thieves. One of which was mocking him while the other one was saying, be quiet. We deserve what we're getting. But this man has done nothing. He is sinless. He is innocent. And then he spoke to Jesus and just asked if it's possible. If it's just possible, would you remember me when you come back with your kingdom? And Jesus said, no, no, no. I'm not going to remember you in the future. I'm going to remember you today. Today you will be with me 